have you. Welcome. My name is Anna. I'm so glad you're here. On my channel, I like to talk about makeup. Um, today I'm doing a Throwback Thursday palette, meaning that I'm pulling out an old, older palette um, that I haven't used in a while uh, to see, to kind of see what I think and see how it's aged. And today I'm using the Temptalia on the Horizon palette. This was a collab between uh, Sydney Grace and Temptalia from, I believe, about two and a half years ago. And yeah, just very pretty. And this is the look. So if you want to see how I got this look and what I think um, of this older palette, then just keep watching. Okay, we're zoomed in a little bit. Eyes are primed with the Anastasia Beverly Hills mini eye primer and I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury finishing powder in one fair today and I'm using like I said the On the Horizon palette from Sydney Grace and Temptalia. So pretty. I cannot believe I have not used this in so long. So let's get a look together. I'm going to start with a fluffy uh, refer 14 into, let's see, I'm gonna do Desert Spoon. I think we're gonna do kind of a green and blue look today. Ooh, those are creamy and soft. I don't know if creamy is the right word. They're just, they're soft. And then I want to take Midnight Courage with um, a smaller, this is a Ruffer 28. And I want to deepen up the outer corners. And I'm going to throw some October Odyssey up um, on my brow bone a bit. Okay, I forgot to press play. <laughs> so this eye is pretty much um, further along than the last one. I think, I think I forgot to press play before I put some of this shade, October Odyssey, um, across here. And then I'll do um, the shimmers on this eye. But this is earthbound um, and that's going to go on the inner third of my eye like so very nice very nice formula um, and then flying high will go on the outer third I wish my fingers were smaller <laughs> for this. I don't though in real life. That would make things harder, I think. I got a little too far over, but that's okay. Um, and then I'm gonna use Lunar Illumination right in the center. I'm gonna finish up or I'm gonna do my makeup rather, and then I'll come back for the, um, for the rest of the eye look. Okay, let's do a lower lash line. I feel like I got some fallout from this. I could, I had a hard time cleaning up, which I, I always have a hard time cleaning that up, but today felt especially like I thought it was cleaned up and then I think I just kind of mixed it in with my concealer somehow. I don't know. Um, so I don't know. <laughs> it's looking a little messy, but that's okay. Um, lower lash line. Um, I think I'm just going to do the shimmery shades uh, that I used on the lid. So using uh, Earthbound in the center, or uh, the inner third. Okay, and then Flying High on the outer third. And again, these are just the same shades that I used on the bottom. I mean the top. All right, and then in the center using Lunar Elimination. I want to use the shade Heart Dog um, on my inner corner. 
expand on my brow bone just a bit. Then I'm going to throw a little bit of mascara on those lower lashes. Okay, this is the final look. And other than it getting a little messy on the bottom, which I think was user error, I really like this. It's kind of like, it's like subtle color. I mean, it's not subtle, it's green and blue, but it's not like super bright vibe. I don't know, it's like almost more colors that you would find in nature. You know, it's not neon colors, it's not, it's, it is actually colors you'd find in nature. I really like this. Sydney Grace has this, I don't want to say delicate, but that's, it's almost like a delicate formula. It's lovely. It's very, I think it's sort of understated, like the shimmers have this like glow to them, but this like very, um, subtle, sophisticated, lovely glow. It's not, um, it's not like beaming. Uh, it's just this like inner glow. It's just pretty. It's pretty. I feel like Sydney Grace is a bit more accessible um, than a lot of indie brands as far as the shades are. Like I said, they're a little bit more subtle. Um, just kind of repeating myself. Anyways, um, very beautiful. I feel like I'm super happy that I pulled this out. Um, I like, I don't know that I love the look that I did today. I do think that that like inner corner looks really pretty though. Yeah, just the shimmers have this like inner glow and I just love them for that. Um, I think it's a very pretty palette. I'm pretty sure these are not available. I think these were limited edition, uh, but if you do have these, um, yeah, I encourage you to pull them out. Uh, very beautiful. I definitely... I definitely like Sydney Grace. Um, if you like shadows that are pretty easy to work with, where you're going to get a more, I think, sort of natural inner glow from within kind of look, I think Sydney Grace uh, is really good for that. A lot of good shadows, very kind of satiny and soft, um, but still pigmented. It's like they're soft, but pigmented. Anyways, um, thanks for being here with me on Throwback Thursday from Temtalia's On The Horizon palette. I hope you're having a good day and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye. Keep on the sunny side, always on the sunny side. Keep on the sunny side alive. It will help us every day. It will brighten all the way if we keep on the sunny side alive.